salvage these underwater thrusters from a project that wasn't being used anymore. I did a basic design in CAD and came up with a delta wing shape. I laser cut this piece from 10 millimeter thick acrylic and that acts as the sort of top surface or wing of the design. To that I screwed on four thrusters and I 3D printed two handles reinforced by two steel rods inside and mounted some waterproof buttons to them to control the thrust of the device. Inside here we have this relatively large battery, a basic microcontroller, which in this case is just an Arduino. That's been used to control the thrusters. I also have some thruster drivers, which are essentially brushless motor controllers. A big challenge of this design is making everything waterproof and submersion proof. So I just used what I had available to keep the cost low and this aluminium box isn't waterproof on itself, but I did put a rubber sheet as an interface between the lid and the bulk of the box. I've also used penetrators, also from Blue Robotics, to bring the cables into the box. These have a small o-ring interfacing on the surface, and they're also filled with epoxy to make the actual cable passing through the bore watertight. So the idea is I'll hold these two handles, go in the water and dive down and activate the thrust. Here we go, hopefully it's watertight and everything holds up. It's really fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so drying this off, gonna open it up and make sure there was no leaks and no water got inside. Cool. I don't see any water in there. Obviously this thing's a rough prototype, so I don't expect it to be like product level quality and last forever. But hopefully it holds up for the beach. <laughs>
was uh, really fun. The uh, visibility wasn't great, but uh, I think there's been a lot of rain, so it's a bit murky. It really gives you a lot of thrust, a lot of power. Uh, the whole time I wasn't like kicking or swimming at all. The battery life's actually better than I thought. It's still going. So yeah, what do you? What did you guys think? It's amazing. Yeah. Really fun. Like functioning as intended. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I mean. Maybe like there's a little bit of water in there, have to check it out later, but yeah, still uh still going strong. <laughs> yeah, the uh, low thrust setting I could program it to be a bit higher, but um yeah. And I guess because the the handles are off plane is uh, they're not on the same plane as the thruster, so it tends to lift you up. So you kind of have to tilt it down to counteract that. But um, yeah, really like gets you to the bottom of course. So might have to come back sometime when there's good visibility. Usually in this area, there's a lot of fish and stuff, but uh, yeah, you couldn't, couldn't see much further than like one meter, a few yeah. yards in front of you. So yeah. You happy with your invention? Yeah, it's not really an invention, they exist, <laughs> but yeah, I'm happy with it. Cool. Nice.